today I'm going to walk you through how to create your own widgets on Advantax Web Access DMP platform. Again, my name is Michelle Holdman and I am an application engineer here at Advantac, so let's get started. First, I'm going to show you how to create a widget using my company stats. I will go to the upper right hand corner of my dashboard and I will click on edit view. Once I do that, then I'll click on company stats. As you can see, there are four company stats already listed. However, today I'm going to show you how to create your own company stat widget. Since data can be expensive, I want to keep an eye on my cumulative data usage. So I'm going to create a widget for that. So let's begin by clicking that add button. Now I'm going to scroll through a list of potential fields and once I find the one I want, I'm going to check the box next to it. So for this example, I'm going to select data up plus down cumulative. Once I click that, as you can see, a new field showed up. Aggregation, so I'm going to click that down arrow to show the different options I have for the aggregation field. So we have count devices, which is the number of devices that meet a specific criteria. Min is the minimum amount of data used. Bottom device is the device with the least amount of data that has been used. Max is for the maximum amount of data used. Top device is the device that has used the most amount of data. Average, as you guessed it, is the average amount of data used across the different devices. And sum is the sum of data used by all devices since they have been connected. For this example, I'm going to choose sum since I would like to know the sum of data used by all the devices that I have selected. Now for widget name, I'm going to select that and delete it because that is a mouthful. So I'm going to type in data usage. Then I'm going to click the save button to save that field. Now see it says the save was successful by that green checkbox. As you can see, the pie charts are still gray, which shows that I have not saved the dashboard. So I'm going to go ahead and click the floppy disk up here above company stats to save the dashboard. As you can see, that save was successful. I hope you have found this video informative. If so, please give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel to see upcoming videos. Thank you and make it a great day.